Jack, Growing Without Expense, Growing Without Expense, Jack. Addressing my executive team once again, you, re you may recall from my first presentation where we talked about the possibilities of creating a selling channel with non-employees of our company and what the possibilities are that lay before us. We talked about initially during that first presentation hiring 12 new employees, which creates salary expense to the bottom line. Thank you for your confidence in the uh, overall way in which the information was relayed to you. The strategic um, value that um, you know, going out to the market and canvassing and recruiting, if you will, um, resellers of their own businesses uh, in the telecommunications industry per se, and inviting them into ours to become sales or uh, members of our organization. The overwhelming outcome over the last six weeks is we wanted to duplicate the thought process of hiring 12 new salespeople. So we went out to bring in 12 new reseller partners. What we ended up doing is bringing in 30 net new reseller partners. <coughs> Each reseller partner, as we've determined, has an average number of sales reps within their organization of three. 30 times three, we now have 90 salespeople <coughs> that have been on the street selling for us over the last six weeks. What have we done as a result of that level of activity? When I looked at the sales funnel this morning, I'm proud to say that we've got $3.5 million worth of net new funnel sales opportunity sitting there. What we've actually done out of that $3.5 million in the last 10 days is closed roughly $650,000 of net new sold business at an expense of zero. Because we already had salaried employees, it's already on our books. We didn't have to hire 12 new salespeople in order to add more salary expense to our business. And yes, we will pay out a commission to the net new 30 businesses that have net new times three 90 salespeople, but it's only at a cost of about one-tenth of what we would actually have been finding ourselves faced with. It's not a successful story. Mm -hmm. Awesome. I, I think it's great because now, <clears throat> can we stop? Absolutely we can if we so chose based on where we are in the market and what, you know, what the future may hold for us because out of the 3.5 million I said we've closed 650. We now have the difference to continue going ahead and closing. What our 90 salespeople are actually doing is adding more to that funnel every week. So it now becomes an ongoing selling machine that's driving more value for us. You also heard me say that along the way, there's the possibility that we can create now a sales incentive model for our channel account managers who are managing these 30 partners. You thought at that time it wasn't a good idea to even consider it because we're talking about a possible expense that we didn't incur over the last three or four years. But I'm happy to say that our CEO over here in a conversation with me three days ago has committed that we will create a sales incentive program for our three channel account managers. That's going to be additional incentives for our sales account managers to continue doing the side-by-side -side mentoring, <coughs> which is what we do here at Toastmasters, <laughs> of these net new 90 salespeople, teaching them more and more about the way we do business why we do business in the marketplace as a service provider, and what it continues to mean to them being a partner, and conclusively to our customers as a sales and corporation organization, if you will, to continue doing business with us each and every day. Net result, you guys are seeing the bottom line. You've asked me every day for the last six weeks, do we think it's going to be possible? You've seen us get on the phone, Myself and my four channel account managers, we pulled the Scots list of 4,000, and we went through 200, and we came away with net new 30 partners. We still have, minus the 30 from the 4,000 that we've actually pulled out of it, that many more to continue calling to continue to grow our business if we see it's necessary to do that. So the outcome is, thank you so much for your support. 
It's been wonderful.